Hey, I'm Gary. This is my T5. This is a 2006 model uh, long wheelbase transport. It's a 2.5. Um, as you probably just saw in the first clip, there, this has already had a 5.1 facelift and I have already lowered it on coil overs as I'm reaching off the bags. And it's um, on some 18 inch steels, uh, smoothies, as you can see. Um, I'm now in the process of turning this into for my work van, into my camp van, and I will insert some photos of the T5 and with my graphics on from when I was a carpenter. Still doing carpentry, just uh, different things now. So, as you can see, this is how it sits. My friend Ryan, uh, Ryan Rudledge, great guy, he's done all the paintwork for me on the front, and I've helped him do the camera conversion in his van. So, this is how my van currently sits. Let's open these doors and piss them down with rain. So currently I have took all my tools out and put them in my new workshop. Um, all stored away nicely. And I did have a sub floor there, which also made like a rock and roll bed for like a day camper. That's also been took out or undone. And I'm now about to strip everything else out. So this is my first video. Don't know how it's gonna go. But hopefully you stick around and uh, we'll see the progress. side and I found insulation already behind those panels. Um, these ones are all going to come off as well down here and here both sides and also I think these are and also all these bottom panels uh, coming off too and there wasn't any already down here so it's a good start. It's another day as I'm in no rush to do this just as and when but all this crap in here I'm going to start tidying out, so I'm going to do that. I'm going to carry on getting the rest of this floor out, um, probably these panels on the side here, maybe even the roof. At least get them all out, one done ready, and then we we'll get back tomorrow. Oh, that's a chore, but uh, that's all tidied out. Thank God. Um, and they're going to crack on with uh, removing the rest of the panel, I think. Chores. As you can see, this is uh, boring and time consuming. So I'm gonna come back to this. No, I'm not gonna come back to this. I'll bring you back to this once all this is out. Uh, and I'm gonna get the floor out. And hopefully, when I see you next, it will just be bare metal. So, yeah. So, as promised, there it is. All the metal work. Uh, getting the rest of the panels out wasn't a problem, obviously. Getting the floor out was a bit of a chore because all the screws were rounded off and they wouldn't come out. But we did it. But the worst thing of all, the worst bit of all, was this floor was covered in mud, glue, whatever that is. There's purple paint over there, which just smeared everywhere. So, right chore. Oh, but look. So, 
everything, all the wood, but I used to have a bulkhead, but here's all out, all the panels are out. It does kind of look dirty, but it's not. I have degreased everything, wiped everything down, all the sides, the back. So, so yeah, there you go. So now I'm gonna get the fan dead in um, and maybe some insulation and start putting some of that in on the panels and the floor and the doors. Um, so yeah, I'll do a little time lapse and you get to see that and uh, some more progress. Sand in this van is a tool. All this side at the top is done. Now I thought I'd start the floor to do something different. And uh, the back end doesn't want to come off. For shit. So I'm going to do this. I'll see you in a bit. So, uh, had a productive night last night. I didn't get indoors till 10.23. Uh, <clears throat> um, all this sand deadened, all the way along behind me. That's just off cut, so I've just stuck on there. All that sand deadened. All the roof is done, as you see in your videos. All the floor is done. And all this side, side door's done. All down there, into the back door. And as you can now see, I'm now getting started on the wheel arches. And then I'm gonna do this side. And then I'm probably gonna fill in these bottom panels along here as well with whatever I can. Plus I'm gonna shove for the insulation as well. So yeah. Oh yeah. Oh. Every panel. I've now gone over them with the same stuff as the floor. All the side panels are done. All the roof is done, the floor's been done. Excuse all this, this is all bits from the van. All this, it's not the neatest job, but my blade, it's the last blade I've got. So, a bit shit, but everything's done. All the bits sound dead than I had left, I've literally just patched in on whatever panel I could, wherever I could, just for extra sound deadening. And I'm now gonna get the carpet out after moving all this shit out and start the carpet in the sides. So, I'm gonna get that, get started, I'll get time lapse going, and yeah, enjoy. Thank you. 
Yo! Would you look at that? The Velcro idea actually worked a treat. Actually, proper hype for that. Stuck in all right. Yes, I know some of the carpet bits in there. We've still got all the carpet to do, so ignore that. But I'll do it. But yeah, that actually worked a treat. It looks darker on the video, I know it's there, but that is actually fine. So you can't tell, it looks like it's stepped out, but that's all good. It does look proper good. And if I ever need to remove it or run wires or anything for some reason behind it, anything at all, I can remove it. Um, bottom ones are gonna be with the hidden clips, like this one, this is the side door. They've all got the hidden panel clips. Panel clips. Panel clips. So yeah, I'm gonna do this arch now and hopefully try to get that in today and uh, enjoy. about the lumps in some of this carpet like here here and here is actually in the carpet this is the first bit i've done i thought it was just me but when i check it in the carpet it's not the greatest but hopefully when the chair's in the back cushion you can see any of this So there you go. I've done a little time lapse then of um I forgot what I've done. What? <laughs> right, so there you go. Uh done a time lapse there of literally the board. Um I already cut the carpet as you probably saw in a couple of little clips ago to fit to make sure I had enough because I was a bit worried. So the board, putting all the hidden clips in, um, they hurt your fingers and that, because you have to push them in and twist them in, but just showing how they all go in. And then the carpet, spraying the glue on, pushing it all down nice, trimming up the carpet around the clips and all that on the back. And then where I've done this carpet on the actual van, as you can see here, I've done it bigger than the actual hole needs to be. So obviously where the holes are, for the clips to go in too, um, I just poked them through again with, drill bit, screw bit, and then uh, just tapped it all in. It's lovely. I don't know if you can see these on the camera, but there's a few little bumps in the carpet. But when the chair's in and the back cushion's on, hopefully you're not gonna see them. So fingers crossed and there you go.
that is pretty much all done other than this top bit which I am now going to be doing but as you can see from all the clips I just showed you everything is now finished absolutely cool two little bits of trim around the edges but I'm going to wait until I get the roof sorted so yeah it's a long job um, I have to admit it did take a lot longer than I expected I have been doing a bit every day and every evening for the last week or so Obviously, you probably could smash this out in a day or two, and most people do just cut it straight over all the panels, which would be a hell of a lot quicker than doing them all individually. But I wanted them to be able to come off and remove them, run wiring behind them, and that. So, all in all, it does look sweet. Absolutely sick. If you get, if you want, give the video a like, press the subscribe button. Uh, this is the first video, I'm definitely going to be doing more. We've got the flooring to do. Uh, the roof to do, all the units to make, the bed to build, so there's going to be a lot more videos. Plus, I ain't just going to be doing videos on my van, I ride BMX and I'm going to be getting a new motocross bike soon, so I'm going to be doing videos of a bit of this, a bit of that, a bit of everything. So yeah, nice one for watching, I'll see you soon.